Are you ready for your miracle today? Leke mishe chama tholwa le na le khon. For the glory. Amen. When I was going there I had the person that I'm supposed to pray for. Let me go and turn again. Nere ke o chika pe abidi. I heard if I start to pray for that person, is here this side, yeah, my brother, come. Yes. Yes. So today God is anointing you uh, for the ministry. You'll be a prophet today. From today, you're a prophet. Yeah. You're a prophet from today. Amen. You're a prophet from today. Can you just go that side there? If you hit there. So you're a prophet from today. In Jesus' name. Those who are fighting you must leave you. Can you follow, Mama? Because you are also crying the same. This pregnancy is giving you a problem. Huh? Yes. Even now. Yes. You are very tired. Mm. Come on, you demon. It's causing this problem. You are leaving her. Where is the wife, husband? It's you. <sighs> you see, my brother, don't worry. After this lady will be delivered. Deliver, I want to sit down with you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Leave her. Huh? What are you doing? What are you doing here? What are you doing? And I'm sure you are surprised. Your wife is screaming like this. Because you have never seen her manifesting. Eh? That's true. Eh? She must listen to you. Eh? Amen. You understand? She must listen to you. She must really listen to you. Amen. Amen. Mama. Where is Mama? The one I was speaking with. The one I was praying for. Where is she? Huh? That Mama does not listen to her husband. And this thing is making this man to suffer. You hear me? You don't listen to your husband. You. You are making this ministry of this man to die. You understand? You must, you must humble yourself. Are you hearing me? Yes. That's why you see this attack on you now. Today, you tell yourself, I'll sit down with you with your husband. Tell yourself that you want to hear your husband eh? yes. and support him. Yes. Eh? yes. Are you going to do that? Yes, I'm going to do it. What were you doing before? I was supporting him. Look at your husband. <laughs> Look at the husband there. Can you see he's shaking his head there? And you say you were supporting him. Okay, you are all free. Okay, let me pray for you. Can you tell us your name and where you come from and also introduce the person next to you? Okay, my name is Mandisa Dosrois and then this person next to me is my husband and we coming from Prakpan. And can you tell us what is it that the man of God said to you today? Uh, the man of God prayed for me and then he told me that um, I've got a demon um, and then that um, this pregnancy is giving me problems um, facing challenges with this pregnancy, which is true. Yeah. Can you tell us what is happening with the pregnancy? Okay, I'm always tired and I always have cramps and then headache. Even at night, I don't sleep. So I've been experiencing those problems like, I don't know for how long now. Yes. And Papa, what are the challenges that you're coming across with your wife? Uh, look, um, since the day she fell pregnant, I actually there was at one stage I thought she was going to lose the pregnancy again as she lost the previous one. And, uh, and uh, look, she's been going through a lot and uh, that doesn't give me peace at all. Imagining what she's going through, you're at work and you can't focus on what you're doing because knowing that she's at home and she's going through situations that you yourself don't know. I've taken her to the doctors. The doctors couldn't see anything wrong on her. And I just didn't know what to do anymore. I used to pray and pray and pray. It seemed like nothing was working. What the man of God said is very true. And I also about what the man of God said, that she's causing suffering in me, it's true. Uh, 
a lot was happening. A lot, a lot. A lot has been happening. Uh, we'll not go into details, but it's very true. Thank you. And I thank, thank God for this deliverance that God really came through for me today. Amen. Glory be to God. And Mama, now that the man of God has prayed for you, how are you feeling? No, I'm okay. And I had a headache today, like the whole day. But after he prayed for me, I'm healed. I thank the Lord. Amen. Any words of encouragement? I just wanted to say that to the people and to the viewers uh, watching Charis TV, please, uh, you may think that you may be a pastor or a apostle or a prophet, thinking that you are okay, you don't have any demon. <laughs> Wait until you come here. Because it might be hiding somewhere there, and, and only the power of God can actually bring it out of you. So my, my encouragement is that come to the church, come experience again, come witness this presence, the presence of the Lord. It's not about the man of God, it's about God. Amen.